For some, asthma is a minor nuisance. For others, it is a major problem that can interfere with daily activities and may lead to a life-threatening asthma attack. We sit down with Dr. Praveen Budiga, the allergy and immunology specialist at the Family Allergy Asthma Clinic in Fresno. He tells you what you need to know about asthma and tips you can do daily to help prevent any flare-ups. Asthma is basically inflammation or allergies in the lungs. One would know that they have asthma if they have uh, a significant cough that has started, um, especially at nights especially in kids in the pediatric population we see this where the parents come in and let us know that uh, oh my child has been coughing all night long uh, i call it the 72 hour rule where uh, if you don't come in within 72 hours you're going to the emergency room because it, it, it asthma is forgiving initially for the first 24 to 36 hours and that's when you should seek care. Some of the common things that trigger asthma are basically dust mite, pollen, tree pollen, grass pollen in the air, um, dust mite, especially in the carpets. Anything that sets off inflammation sets off uh, asthma. COVID-19 is an inflammatory trigger, so therefore it is uh, fair to say that it is a trigger for asthma. Asthma by itself is caused by allergies. 85% of asthma has allergic triggers. So if you have dust mite, avail uh, dust mite exposure, if you have tree pollen exposure, grass pollen exposure, um, weeds or mold pollen, uh, mold spores exposure, you're gonna see a lot of uh, triggers for asthma and uh, my, our goal here in, in my clinic, uh, Family Allergy Asthma Clinic, is to first identify uh, what are these triggers that are causing your asthma. Once we identify them, that's the most important part, there are other things to mitigate allergies and asthma and that's very simple, at, uh, you can do this at home, um, is nasal rinses. Um, just to clean out the, uh, especially in the, at the end of the day or early in the morning uh, before you go, go to work, or um, is to basically use a nasal rinse um, just to take out all the pollen and all the dust that triggers asthma from the nose in the area uh, or allergies from the nose, you know, which eventually cascades down to asthma.